Hi everyone, welcome back to My Creative Ego. So I figured since it's daylight savings time for some of us, we fall back an hour. So I figured this would be the best way to start today's video off with. So I did pick up these Bow Bunny stamps for $2.99. Really great, I think, if you're using it for Thanksgiving, especially as placemats or even for like name cards and table settings. So you'll see my haul video as I talk about what's been going on with my computer as well as the tonic items at Tuesday morning. So for the past month, my computer storage has been filling up and I've been deleting files here and there, but then it got to the point where it was just too full. So I barely was able to put in that Daiso upload, my last video, and you know, I had to invest in an external hard drive, which was kind of pricey. So I told myself, maybe I'll offset that price by not showing up to Tuesday morning one or two times and wrong, wrong, wrong decision to make this week, right? Because all the tonic products were showing up at the store. So yes, I was so super tardy for that party. <laughs> So I show up to Tuesday morning at the end of the week and of course there's really nothing much there and I did find a few tonic items but as you can see small, medium, and large those were all priced at $9.99. There was this other one that was $3.99 but luckily these were not the designs I was looking for so the price point really didn't bother me too much. So I'm going to be going to Tuesday morning of course. You will see another Tuesday morning haul video very soon because I am determined to find some of these tonic items that I am looking for. Um, in the meantime, this item that you're seeing right now, this is an Inka Dinka Do product. I thought this was one of the best bargains that I found. So you're getting a total of 16 stamps that cover anything from graduation to parties to birthdays to congratulations. And I thought this was a really great deal because $1.49, 16 stamps, that's about nine cents a stamp. And I gotta tell you guys, my favorite one is actually the star, the star stamp that you see here. You can use this with your stamping gear, which I did here. If you're not familiar with the stamping gear, I did a tutorial on this. I'll leave it in the description box down below as well as at the end of the video. So you can click on that if you want to as well. And another benefit to the Inka Dinka Do items is the leftover packaging, which I'm gonna show you how to upcycle here in a bit. In the meantime, I'm gonna tell you about this set of Bow Bunny stamps. This one's actually called Quotations, but the SKU number description's a little bit different. So this is Bow Bunny Quotation Stamps, and it comes with six pieces, and I'm just gonna read them out really quickly. This is my favorite one. It says, there are hundreds of languages, but a smile speaks them all. You are my moon and stars. Every job is a self-portrait of the person who does it. Autograph your work with excellence. Life doesn't have to be perfect to be wonderful. And remember that you're the one who can fill the world with sunshine. <laughs> so using the star stamp from the Inka Dinka Do item and some of these quotes from the Bow Bunny stamp, as well as the leftover packaging on the Inka Dinka Do product, I was able to create this little magnet and it's a shaker magnet, but it's also, once again, a really great way to upcycle some of that extra packaging that you get from these products. So I did use a tape strip magnet from Daiso, and I'm not sure if I put this on my last haul video, but if I didn't, I'll just show you real quickly. These are some of the magnets that I picked up from Daiso. So as you can see, you have your circle metal magnets as well as the adhesive backed um, magnetic strip. So I made this shaker magnet and then I thought it would be a good idea to kind of use these quotes as well to kind of decorate some envelopes. And as you can see on this envelope, it has a little moon to kind of match that quote that was on there that says, you are my moon and stars. So the moon actually came from the tonic punch that came out earlier in the year. And speaking of that tonic punch, I was able to pick up these purses, these little coin 
not coin purses. I guess you could use them as a coin purse though, but they are purse keychains. And as you can see, the tonic punch actually fits in there. So if you're wondering what size this is, it is kind of tiny. I do love using these for graduation where you can actually put the graduation gift in here as well. So this was $2.49. I bought the periwinkle blue one, and then I also bought the gold one, and each of them actually have a different SKU number. So the next item is by Spellbinders. It's called Royal Love, and they provide a really beautiful sample of how they use this. I figured I would use mine on one of these little card boxes or box cards. I'm not sure what you call it, um, but I thought it turned out really, really great. And you don't actually have to use it as this one solid piece. So as you can see here, I took the middle of the heart and I put that on the center. And then instead of having the sides continue horizontally, I just centered them onto the card and I just turned them vertically. So it's, you know, you can definitely use the heart, you can cut these up in different areas and then you can use them as decoration that way. I also do want to do a special edition Tuesday morning haul with a theme of Alice in Wonderland. So if you haven't already, please don't forget to hit subscribe. And if you want to see how I use the stamping tool for the Inka Dinka Doo products, I'll put that on here as well. And I didn't quite finish my Daiso haul, so there will be a part two, but if you want to catch part one of the Daiso haul, it'll be right here. 